Without local bandwidth or local data usage how to sync or transfer data from Telebox to Dropbox. First, use Google to search for CloudSlinker. Then, click on CloudSlinker in the search results to proceed. Or you can directly enter the address for CloudSlinker to proceed. CloudSlinker is a cloud-based transfer tool that supports up to 40 different cloud storage platforms. Click the Get Started button to access the application. You can either log in directly or create a free account. CloudSlinker provides 10 gigabytes of data transfer per month. For free accounts, after entering CloudSlinker, let's first add a Telebox. Click Telebox on the Add page to add it, an access token is required. Let's find out how to get a token. First, visit the web version of Telebox or open the mobile app. Click My Account to access your Telebox account. Find the token section and click Copy to copy it. After obtaining the token, return to CloudSlinker, enter the token, and click Add to complete the addition of Telebox. After adding, we can access our Telebox via CloudSlinker. Next, we'll add Dropbox to CloudSlinker. The authorization method for adding Dropbox is Oath2. CloudSlinker will open a Dropbox authorization page provided by Dropbox where you need to complete the authorization process and grant CloudSlinker access. Once you complete the setup, you can access your Dropbox content on CloudSlinker. Next, let's create a transfer task. Click the transfer button to access the transfer settings page. Select Telebox as the transfer source on the source side. Select Dropbox as the transfer target in the target section and create a new directory there for the transfer. CloudSlinker supports to transfer modes, copy and move. The main difference between them is whether the source file is deleted after transfer. Click Transfer to start the transfer task. Click Task on the left to view the currently active transfer tasks. With CloudSlinker's powerful servers, our small demo data is transferred almost instantly. In CloudSlinker, click on Dropbox to check if the transfer is complete. Alternatively, you can check the Dropbox official website to see if the files have truly been transferred.